But isn't water cooling dangerous? You'd think the most expensive and high capacity data centers in the world would avoid mixing water and electronics, but liquid has been used to cool enterprise hardware for just as long, if not longer, than home enthusiast PCs. And Google shared an update on their methods at Hot Chips 2025, as reported by Chips and Cheese. They use CDUs, or coolant distribution units, like we saw at Cooler Master back at Computex, to transfer heat from each server's coolant loop to a facility level water supply that can also be externally chilled. Amazon uses a similar system in their data centers on a massive scale, and there's just something about the densely packed hardware, tubing runs, and specifically designed copper block assemblies in these units that stirs a primal hardware enthusiast part of me that has long slumbered. Google says their liquid cooled fleet has 99.999% uptime since 2020, and not a bit of RGB to be seen in these rigs either. For more, check out Tech News this weekend, but at least for now, you don't have to ask yourself.